and welcome to our workshops. Now, I know we all have to stay in the house, so we got our thinking caps on and we thought about what would be fun for you boys and girls to do in the house. Now, I love to sing and I love to act and I love to make things. So, I decided our workshops would be singing, acting, and crafts. Now they'll all be on a theme each week. And today's theme is one of my favorites. Let's see if you could guess what my theme is. I have a few props that will give you a little bit of a hint. Now let's see, here's my first prop. Mm, it's a big one. It's a sharp one. It's a dangerous one. So we have to be very careful. <gasps> it's a sword. Oh, it's a very long sword. People use it to fight. Let me see your best fighting faces. <sighs> very good. So it could be a lot of things. A lot of things use swords. Now, let's see. This one might give it away. It's small. You wear it. It's black. And it covers your... Eye! <gasps> oh! Has anybody guessed it so far? I'm wearing an eye patch. Who wears an eye patch? That's right. Pirates do! <gasps> so I must get my pirate hat on. Oh, here we go. <gasps> I'm definitely looking like a pirate now. My sword, my hat, and my eye patch. And I have lots of fun things in store for you today. Now, for our first thing today, we're going to meet all the pirates. Now, they have some fun names. And maybe later on, we might pick out our own pirate names too. So, are we ready to meet the pirates? Okay. Aboard a rocky pirate ship in the middle of the sea. Pirates who are as useless as can be. <sighs> There's Pirate Jim who cannot swim. <gasps> There's Pirate Dave who's scared of waves. <gasps> Nick gets <gasps> seasick. <gasps> Pirate Dale, who can not sail, <gasps> and Pirate Pete with. bunch of pirates you could ever wish to meet. Isn't that a great poem all about pirates? But I bet if you were a pirate or if you were a pirate or even if I was a pirate, I would be a lot scarier and braver than those silly pirates. I think they're in the wrong job. 
Now, we're going to see the poem again. And this time, all the words are going to be up above me. So we're going to give it a go together. Are we ready? Let's give it a go. Meet the pirates. Aboard a rocky pirate ship in the middle of the sea are a funny group of pirates who are as useless as could be. There's Pirate Jim. They cannot swim. <gasps> Pirate Dave, who's scared of waves. Ooh. Pirate Nick, who gets... Huh. Ooh. Ooh. Seasick! Pirate Dale, who cannot sail. Pirate Pete, with oh, oh, smelly feet. The most useless bunch of pirates you could ever wish to meet. Well done everybody. That deserves big, big claps. Now, we've met those pirates. Now it's time to make you into a pirate. Now everyone, we met the pirates and I said we will meet you as pirates. But first, you have to find out my name. My name is Rihanna. Now that's my real name. But what would my pirate name be? Hmm. And I have a way of finding out. Let's see. So, we take the first letter of your first name. Mine's is Rihanna, so it's an R. Now let's say, what would R be? <gasps> It would be Miss. Mmm, I like that. And then we take the first letter from your middle name. So my real name is Rihanna Emer. So we're looking for an E. Let's see. What name am I getting? George? I don't think I look like a George. But maybe my pirate name looks more like a George. Let's see. So my name so far is Miss George. Hmm. I hope I get a good one for my last name. So my full name is Raina Emer Wright. But it's not with an R. This one's with a W. Hmm. So let's see. What would my full pirate name be when I have a W to start? <gasps> Three gates. So my name is Miss George Three Gates. Oh, I hope you have better names than me. I would like to hear them. Do you send them in? Have a bit of fun and see if anybody in your family or if any of your friends have any really cool pirate names like I would like to be Pig Leg Crackle 
Mm, swashbuckler. I think I really love Swashbuckler. I wish that was my name. <gasps> or Dirty Jack Blackbeard. There's some really cool pirate names. I hope you get really, really fun ones. Hmm. Or my final choice would be Stinky. Um, Jack Silver. Hmm. Stinky Jack Silver. I think Stinky Jack Silver would have lots of uh, smelly socks. Oh, definitely. I think these socks are in need of a wash. And not just a pirate wash, a real wash. Ugh. So now I want you to find out your pirate name. Okay, so it's time for our pirate-themed song. Now, some of you might already know this song. If you've ever watched Pirates of the Caribbean. Mm, I love that film. Now, we're going to learn Yo-Ho! Yo-Ho! A Pirate's Life for me. Have we got our singing voices ready? Very good. Now, we're going to learn this song by singing and repeating. So that means I'll go first and then you'll all join in. So me first. Are we ready? Okay. Yo! are going to appear above my head. But try your best and sing along and see how many you remember. Okay? Let's give it a go together. Yo! Again, that was wonderful. Yo, yo, a pirate's life for me. We pillage and plunder, we rifle and loot, drink up me hearties, yo ho. We kidnap and ravage and don't give a hoot, drink up me hearties, yo ho. Yo. Oh, 
wonderful and I loved your big pirate voices. Hi, me arties. Are you ready to sing your pirate song or walk my pirate ship plank? Let's get ready with the music. Let's give it a go. Yo ho, yo ho, a pirate's life for me. We pillage and plunder, we rifle and loot. Drink up, me hearties, yo ho. We kidnap and ravage and don't give a hoot. Drink up, me hearties, yo ho. Yo ho, yo ho, a pirate's life for me. We pillage and plunder, we rifle and loot. Drink up, me hearties, yo ho. We kidnap and ravage and don't give a hoot. Drink up, me hearties, yo ho. Yo ho, yo ho, a pirate's life for me. Yo ho, yo ho, a pirate's life for me. Well done, everybody. That was wonderful. Big, big claps. It's our arts and crafts time. Now, I have not one, not two, but three pirate things we can make using stuff we've got in the house. So, for this, you'll need a few things. We will need some paper and a pencil or a pen. We will need some scissors. Now, scissors are very dangerous, so we'll need a little bit of help if we're very young to cut out some of the things we have to do. And we will need some lollipop sticks or straws or even pencils we can use again. And we need some sellotape. Any sellotape will do. But the last thing we need is the most exciting. We need some beautiful colouring and pencils or crayons or even some paint. It's up to you. Now, the first thing that we are going to make today is something that all the pirates would say quite often they would see some lovely, colourful <gasps> fish. Oh, now, I like my fish to be nice and rainbow coloured, but you can make yours any colour you like. Now, I used a lovely stick for mine, but remember, you can use anything you want. You can follow my little video now on how to make your fish.
next thing that we're going to make today is a pirate. Oh, I love pirates. Now this is a friendly pirate and he has a lovely smile on his face. And this is a little puppet made for your fingers. So would you like to meet my pirate friend? His name is Pirate Pete. Pirate Pete, would you like to say hello? Don't be shy, Pirate Pete. Everybody's lovely. Go out and say hello. Oh, boys and girls, I think we all have to shout hello first. Are you ready? Hello! Pirate Pete, come on. Okay, how about we shout, Hello, Pirate Pete? Are we ready? Hello, Pirate Pete! Oh, boys and girls, he's coming. Oh, he's peeking up. And he's got a patch just like me. And a lovely curly moustache. And what else has he got? Oh, he's got a hook for a hand. That must come in very useful when he's fishing. And here he comes. He's saying hello. Hello, Pirate Pete. Hello, boys and girls. <laughs> oh, he's not too shy. But Pirate Pete has a friend. A very colourful friend. And that's the third thing we're going to make today. Isn't that right, Pirate Pete? That's right. So, I think we're going to find out how to make Pirate Pete's best, best friend. So, Pirate Pete's best, best friend is... Percy Parrot! <gasps> Percy Parrot, you are lovely. You've got lovely purple and pink and yellow feathers. Pirate Pete's very lucky to have you as a friend. And I think Percy likes to sit on top of Pirate Pete's shoulder. <gasps> it's really like a real pirate and it's Pirate's best friend. So boys and girls, I want your parrot to be as colourful and as beautiful as you like and make sure you give your beautiful parrot and your wonderfully feathery parrot a lovely parrot name and parrot name. I can't wait to hear them. Now, the last thing I have to do to make myself into a real pirate is maybe give myself a piratey moustache. Let's see. One curly one. Let's see. And another one. I do like my moustache. It reminds me of somebody. Hmm. I wonder who. <gasps> it was Pirate Pete. Now, let's see. He had a lovely beard. 
it was kind of stubbly. One, two, three, hmm, four, five, six, uh oh, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Oh, I think I do look like a pirate. Maybe I need to put on my eye patch. Let's see. Whoop, under all the hair. That's right. Up it goes. Looking a little bit more like a pirate. Hmm. And now I think I'm missing my pirate captain's hat. <gasps> Let's see. Up it goes. Oh. No, oh, I think this way. Oh, I'm looking like a pirate now. That's it. Maybe I need a parrot on my shoulder. <gasps> Maybe. And finally, I need a pirate sword. Now, boys and girls, let me hear your best pirate. Arr, me could you do it again? Hi, me arties. Well done. What did you think? She thought it was very good. So, if you want to make yourselves into a pirate, just like me, I used some eyeliner. Now, we only do it if our mums and dads or our guardians or whoever is lucky enough to be watching us lets us and they can help. You can use eyeliner or you can use face paint, whatever you have in the house. And remember to take a piratey picture. Hi, me hearties. Very good. <laughs> Wonderful pirate faces. So boys and girls, let's remember what we did today. We met the pirates. Although I don't think they were very scary pirates. They were a bit silly and they had oh, smelly feet, didn't they? Mm-hmm. We find out our pirate names. We made much better pirates than those silly bunch. We sang a pirate song. Yo-ho, yo-ho, a pirate's life for me. We made some pirate puppets. We did. Lovely finger puppets. And remember, he had a friend. <gasps> That's right. And we made one last puppet. Can we remember what it was? <gasps> we made a beautiful, colourful fish. can float, can swim, and it's happy in the sea. Isn't that right, boys and girls? That's right. And finally, we made ourselves into the best pirates ever with curly moustaches and Doubly beards. Mmm. It's definitely a pirate's life for me. So, boys and girls, remember to send us photos of you as a pirate with your best pirate face. <sighs> and maybe your pirate puppets. <gasps> 
and even videos of you saying your pirate poems and singing your pirate songs. I hope you had the most wonderful time today. And remember, next week, it's not about pirates. It will be about something just as fun. And I can't wait to see you all again.